I'm dead ass so shook as I'm making a video about it. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone. Right, people, listen up, sisters. Well, it's not still James uh, Charles Brown in case he's, you know, claimed sisters, but I doubt it. Um, <laughs> some geezer has dead ass tried to be me on TikTok, right? I'm going to insert like screenshots. Um, so jennifer who i follow on tiktok i'll put her name down here love jennifer i love her little tiktoks here they bring me a lot of joy um basically she put a tiktok on saying like um just saying this once do not spread hate or anything on my content like this is like a place for people to enjoy pretty much and just be like nice people so i was like oh my god so sorry about to be through that hope you're okay and she was like oh don't worry blah 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 blah. and then messaged me saying one of the girls had pretended i'm gonna like do screenshots um had pretended to be me and had my picture and i was like what so i like i was like how has she got my picture because the only place i put it is my instagram one is open instagram i'm making scared maybe i should just stop doing like i might stop doing social media because i'm scared <laughs> um you know, i'm not really doing it but like i'm not doing it i have 4k followers on tiktok and still someone trying to be me huh um yeah on my i think it might be on my youtube instagram and it is on my normal instagram that like you can follow if you want but like i don't post youtube related stuff on there so you probably wouldn't want to follow that anyway so i don't know how she's got it and it was like a proper picture clear picture so i was like weird weird I really don't know how she's got it. Unless, because if you do search Lady McClung uh, on Instagram, then it will come up with my private account probably and the YouTube account. So I don't really know. Anyway, I was like, what? I went onto her TikTok. There's about five videos of me, of dead as a me, right? On there. I was like, huh? So I like, went through it <laughs> and I was like, I'm scared. And she's like obviously cropped in. You can tell when videos are cropped in and not like the original because she obviously had to crop my name out because like on TikTok like it automatically kind of like like what's the word trademarks it brands it for you. So it has like a Lydia McClung three coming from you with the corners. So whenever you watch a video that's from TikTok, you'll see that unless it's like put on Instagram and it's been cropped out, you know. But um, that happened and I was like looking at it and I was like this is so scary. She's sixty followers. I was like okay, she's doing all right for herself. Do you know what I mean? Like she's done okay. She's like. 600 likes or something on five videos i'm like am i actually doing okay at tiktok like huh sorry me anyway so i <laughs> me being the little snake i am commented on one of the tiktok saying um like i'll put a little screenshot up oh my god she popped off loki looks like me though crazy um and then she literally must delete the comment because then i got a notification say tagging me saying i'm trying to be her and i'm thinking hold up honey your account did you start like a month ago my account's been getting on since january and i could just show my face and do a live stream straight to people at tiktok and they can see it's me i don't know how you're gonna look like me honey so <laughs> like yeah that happened and there was this fake account that followed me for ages i knew i kind of thought it was a fake account because of like the content they posted and where they posted it so i kind of was just like a bit skeptical of it and then i looked at who followed it because i had some people in my mind i was like who hates me enough <laughs> to do that and i was like i knew some people like don't like me i kind of in person and i looked through the followers and i was looking for like certain people that i knew that she'd probably be following um didn't see the name but i seen this olivia rowe girl um and i was like she follows me and i reckon she started this account so i blocked that olivia girl which is weird because my name's Olivia, and I blocked the GG Louie whatever account, um, and reported the girl who was trying to be me, and I said, this is me, honey, so I don't know whether her account's been deleted now, or she's just blocked me so I can't find her account, but yeah, I then make a TikTok about it, and then one TikTok I post, like when I post a TikTok, like, not to brag, but like, in the first 10 minutes, I had like one or two views, you know? famous i see b <laughs> um and like this one tiktok i posted did not get any views and it's still not on any views either tiktok's like checking it and making sure and making sure it's okay for like you know tiktok and it's like not going against any of the guidelines or like someone's reported me for being them so then i posted another tiktok saying basically thank you jennifer for telling me and like i'll, I'll post a pic the tiktok here now 
I'm dead ass you're gonna have to make this because I literally have 4k followers but okay with me thank you so much to Jennifer for letting me know about this but um this little girly pops here is not me uh she's took some of my videos stunning lovely she could have at least picked a nice little thing for my face but we ignore um she's done well for herself this little girl 325 likes you know she's made it to top of a hashtag I did comment on one because I'm a crazy gal, you know, of my video of my hair transformation. She popped off crazy. <laughs> but at the end of the day, this is not me. Please do not follow or even acknowledge. Report this account, actually, because this is literally pretending to be me. And that is actually not good. So I posted that. Oh, my God, Reggie's barking. Or oh, such might be Flynn. And then, yeah, I can't find her account. Like, one of my videos. Like, one of my videos did get about, how many views? I think it's on, like, 600,000 views. And the girl got, like... Well, I'm assuming it's a girl. It could be a boy, but because it's me, I'm just going to say it's a girl. Um, and I think it only got, like, 1,000 views. Um, but it got, like, quite a few likes. So it put it at the top of, like, this hashtag sound. And I was like... I, I want the clout. So that's what's happened today. I have to write that in. I'm starting a notes thing, a notes form thing, called embarrassing stories. Things that I do that... Just, I'm stuff happens to me that wouldn't happen to the normal person and it does shock me as well as everyone that i tell so i will be putting that in because let's be honest i'm not anyone you want to be like if i see me down the street i'd be like oh god like, you know, that's exactly how i'd look at me i would not think i'm going to go home and steal her tiktoks because that'd be the last thing i'd think about doing i might i wouldn't even be like let's go and bloody find her instagram so i'm just like beyond shook if and i thought you know what i'll make a video about it because i like, maybe this has happened to someone else like it must happen to like famous people like do you know what i mean like you don't know every famous person like i bet you could say to me a name i'd be like who's that and then so they get away with like mimicking people and obviously like the girl who i lived the olivia girl the other olivia girl oh my god was like copying someone from the hype house or whatever house it was that's like a big you know tiktok house so obviously more people knew about them and nobody knows about me you know you know so shook if times i i was like do i take it as a compliment that people think i my content is good enough to copy like to literally pretend to be have i been trolled is that what trolling is she wasn't horrible she just posted my stuff like first tiktok do you know what i mean very weird very weird and I need to walk my dog and I was literally just about to go on a walk on my dog with my dog um about half an hour ago and Jennifer messaged me like hello just like let you know I think one of us pretend to be you and I was like hello thank you for letting me know who she was she uh, like panic and then in my video I was like if this carries on I will sue her for defamation let's be honest no I will not I do not have the money to bring a court case um nor probably enough evidence or legs to stand on let's be honest but if she has said stuff about me pretend to be me wait could it even be defamation i don't think it could be defamation because she hasn't said anything about me she pretended to be me oh and i like a thick cow i said i'm like I'm doing a law degree so i'll tell you for defamation it wouldn't even be defamation it'd literally be impersonation but i don't even know anything about that because i haven't learned anything about that so now i need to find out stuff about that in case i need to <laughs> I low key want to cry. This is so stressful. How do people cope with this? I might not ever post a YouTube video or TikTok video again. So if I don't, just know it's because I've decided um, just to study, focus on my law degree and get a law degree and not face not getting a job just in case somebody has decided to be me and spread lies and said things I'd never say. I just hope they haven't been mean to anyone, but apparently they have been mean to people. I like bullied people. I don't like that. I just want to love everyone. And I don't want people to be sad because of something it looks like I said. I just want people to be happy. And if it looks like I've made someone sad, I'm sad. I'm sad about this. Because apparently they were bullying a girl on, on Jennifer's TikTok. So... I just really didn't think I was like... I didn't think that would happen to me. I didn't think it would happen to me. My account was so small. And why would they comment on Jennifer's? How do they find Jennifer? Because Jennifer doesn't really comment a lot on my stuff. Do you know what I mean? She likes a lot, but she doesn't comment a lot. I don't know. 
maybe they found me through Jennifer. Who knows? Whoever this is, very childish, very immature, but low-key, what the frick? Scared. <laughs> what the hell? This has literally been 10 minutes. I don't know whether it will still be 10 minutes and I've edited it. Of me just telling you how someone's pretend to be real on TikTok. What is this world? Anyway, thank you so much for watching this story time slash rant with me. What the freak? So be careful if you are posting on TikTok. Not to deter, 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 deter. That word, deter. I think it is deter. Anyone from posting on TikTok or social media. But this is a a reality that I didn't know I'd face. I just um hope TikTok has deleted their account because uh, it's not me and hopefully me blocking them will be enough because obviously if they then follow me as being them I'm not gonna know who they are I'm so scared <laughs> I'm so scared luckily like I don't think you can find where I live oh my god I've got a TikTok that's at my house okay I'm gonna literally private that now because I'm scared be careful people stranger danger the real thing and um, social media can be scary so just watch your back she's a mona lisa everyone